guys today I'll show you how to get MIDI files from the Cthulhu VST and the first thing you'll need to do is have some drivers installed if you're on a Mac like I am you'll just head over to audio devices and you'll head to Windows click on show MIDI studio and your IAC driver should be online that's how you get to it if it's offline you just check it and it should be online All right, so I'll exit this and if you're on a PC you'll need to download this <coughs> called IP MIDI and you just head over from to download it's called loop loopy so after you have that installed The second thing you should do is open up your DAW and you head over to your MIDI settings and uh, the drive that you just installed should be right here as output and input as well and it, uh, you'll need to enable the input. Alright, the second thing you'll need to do is open up the VST you want to use and your Cthulhu VST. I already selected um, the preset. So you'll head over to your settings and you'll change your output. And when you change your output, it should match this output as the same driver you installed. So my output is 2 at the moment, so I'll change my output here at 2, and then for massive, I'll change the input to 2 as well. So whatever you play from Cthulhu, you should, it should go through massive. There's a lot of issues with the Mac Alpha FL Studio. Alright, so I'll go ahead and press record everything and I'll record an idea that I have. size everything All right after I'm finished <clears throat> the VST I want to get the MIDI files on I'll just highlight it which will be massive for me and I'll go ahead and mute this and uh, so highlight massive press record again and record everything and just play and the MIDI files should appear on the massive VST all right and there you go the exact notes from Cthulhu I'll also be making a logic version of this so the video should be in the description box below and thanks for watching Thank you.